All right, so real quick, I'm going to show you how to install Reshade for Starfield. I'm going to be using Star Vision Reshade, just as an example one. But this should work for basically any any of the three shades you're going to be using for this game. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our browser here. We're going to go to this link here to Nexus Mods to grab the Star Vision Reshade. Now, I'll put all the links that you need down in the description. So we're going to go here to Nexus Mods, and we're going to go to Files. We're going to go to Manual Download. Now, you're going to have to have a Nexus Mods account to download this, but it's free. You can, you can make one really fast. Once we're here, we're going to go ahead and just click on Slow Download. Let this download. Okay, once that's downloaded, we can go, go up right up to here and click on this and open this up. And in here, you see that we have this StarVision version 1.any file. We are going to go to our StarField directory where our StarField exe is, which for me is going to be on C, Program Files, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, StarField. This is the path right here where you can find your StarField exe. Here's our StarField exe right here. So we know we're in the right place. We can just go ahead and just drag this over here and copy it over. And now that's in there. That's the first step done. The next thing we need to do is we need to go get reshades. What we're going to do is we're going to go back to our browser. But we're going to go ahead and go to this URL here at reshade.me. Right here at the top, we're just going to click on this big purple download button. And what we do is right here is we're just going to go ahead and click on this and download reshade. We are going to hit this exe and run it. Now, if you don't have this drop down on the top right, you can go to your downloads folder and click on it there. All right, so in here, we are going to go ahead and go search and we're going to get star field. We're going to start for the exe right there. We go ahead and click next. Now, if you're using Game Pass, you're going to go ahead and, and you're going to click on game launcher helper.exe instead. I don't have Game Pass, so I'm not going to be doing that. I'm going to be using the Steam version. Everything else is the same. Only difference is, is you need to go locate that game launcher helper.exe and install it there. And we're going to go ahead and select Microsoft Direct X 12, which is this one right here. So we're going to click next on that. Now select preset to install. So what we want to do is we want to hit browse and we want to navigate to our Starfield directory. So we're going to go to this directory right here. This is what we were in before. We're going to go ahead and find our Star Vision version one right here. We're going to go ahead and open that and click next. And in here, it's already selected the ones we need for this particular reshade. So we're going to go ahead and just click next and it's going to install those for us. All right, and it's done. And we can go ahead and just click finish. All right, with all of that done, now we can go ahead and launch our game. And as you can see up here on the top, you can see that reshade is running. So we know reshade is installed successfully. So now that we're in the game, we're going to go ahead and click home on the keyboard and here is the tutorial you can go through this if you want but i'm going to just skip the tutorial and here we are you can see that star vision is selected here now what we're going to do just to double check and we can hit reload just to really make sure and now the star vision reshade should be running this should work with any of your reshades as we can see the reshade is running right now here's my dude with his cool hat and his nice suit and we can pull up the reshade menu anytime you want using the home key. Now you don't have to do this, this is completely unnecessary, but I'm gonna do this because I, I like doing this. It's very nice. You can go in here to home, and you click on settings. And right here you can set a effect toggle. So we'll turn the effect on or off so you can really check what it changes, if it's working or not. I set mine to shift home as you can see there. And that's all you gotta do to get reshade installed and working on your computer. Should work with any of the reshades that are out there. And that's all you gotta do.